Hey guys and welcome back to a brand new video and again a brand new series or uh, at least I'm, I think it may be a series, it depends how this video goes. So this is Ether 1, uh, this came out today with the free PlayStation Plus games. Uh, this is a brand new game as well and it's pretty cool, I say this every time, pretty cool how they let us have free games on day one. Uh, but anyway, uh, all I know is it's a puzzler, first person puzzler, that's it. I, I haven't seen gameplay or anything, this is literally the first time I turn it on, so let's go. It looks really pretty so far, uh, at least on the menu and that. Uh, start new game. Let's see, are we already playing? Oh, right, no, empty. I thought it was going to be a typical game where we started moving directly from here, but it doesn't look like it. It looks like it's going to be a cutscene or something first. Listen, I, I'm sorry for the things I said earlier on. It's just... God, I really don't think you should go to that place. I, I, don't, I don't think they care. Not like they should. And before you think it, I know how it feels to want to feel safe, to want more. You know I do it, but, but Jesus, do, do you know how they view you? Just another patient to squeeze money out of. Please, don't go tonight. <sighs> I'm freaking scared. Wow, fucking subtitles are a bit out of, uh, out of synchronization, but uh, okay. Press square to interact. Right, we open that. Graphics kind of weird. It looks okay, I guess. Uh, can we not run? Uh, hold to identify objects of interest. Hold L1. In the 19th century, advances in genetic and psychological sciences led to a series of astounding breakthroughs. At the institute. What's that? Press square. Okay, another button over here. Looks like. You need to gain access to the lower floor, so this looks like some kind of key card or something. How the hell do I know where, where I'm pressing? There's literally no marker, no one... I've got to guess where it is, okay. Yeah, you got it straight away. Right, um... We done? Okay. My name stayed on there? Oh yeah, it has. Date, time. Okay. Right, we've got to head on down to some chamber number three or something like that. I really wish we could run. Okay, we can zoom in just like in PT. Goddamn PT, by the way. Hold an object, press to exterminate. Yeah, but am I, how do I know what I'm holding? I'm really sure what we're doing right now. There's got to be a button to run, please. Okay, we can, are you telling me that we can crouch but we can't run? Are you serious? Oh, no, wait. We, we can run. L3. That helps quite a bit, actually. Are we in the same place as before? I don't think so. I'm actually quite lost right now. Nah, 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 I want to know what's in there. There's some kind of robot thing with a laser in there, I want to know what it is. Now. Did say before that we have to head down somewhere, but... I don't know. <laughs> I think we've been through all these doors anyway, or not. Maybe we haven't been down here. Okay, it looks like we may be going the right way now. We're heading down at least. Restoration chamber one and two. I think you said number three. We'll never look in here anyway. Number three is this one. Right then. I want to know what I am. I think I'm some kind of robot. Or not. What the fuck are they doing? I don't know really, it depends what you're going to do. I guess that's a yes. Okay, listen up. You are in your case. You're probably going to come back here a lot, so please take some time to get acquainted with your surroundings. It keeps most restorers sanity intact. For a short while, anyway. Okay, this looks like the Nexus. We've got the pinwheel. It's pinwheel industrial. 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 
Good shit. Pinwheel Village. Pinwheel Harbour and Brimcliff Mines. Okay, then. Let's teleport to... Okay. Yeah, but where do I go? Do I just go to a random place? The hell are we, though? So we're, so we're kind of in somebody's memory, apparently. Something like that. And we got to find something? I don't know. It's a weird shit, to be honest. This place looks pretty abandoned to me. Devlin Mine. I still don't know why there's, like, four doors in the Nexus. I'm just going to call it the Nexus, guys. In the Nexus, and you press triangle, and you just go to some place. I'm not too sure where we are. Maybe we can go through those doors later on or something. Or we can still only hold one item at a time. I'm going to go for... No, wait. We can open this. I'm going to go for the... Uh... No, no, wait. This paper... For fuck's sake. It looks really important. Such an idiot. I'm not going to bother reading that. Right, I'm going to keep the spanner since it's probably the most important thing I've found so far. See what we can do with that. Hmm. It says D11 there. That's probably a clue. No, in these type of games. Where do we go? Where's down? Oh, okay. It was... No, okay. Right, I've, it looks like we found something, but it can't be D11 because um, it's all numbers, I think. So now we're going to have to probably find a piece of paper or something with a code on it. Or we could go around opening every single thing and hope for the best. I think there's a paper up there, but I'm not too sure. It's like a drawing or something, let's see. Uh, no, is there maybe numbers on here? Maybe I got. I'm gonna take it out to the sunlight or something. Yeah, that's not helping much. <laughs> For God's sake! Right, maybe we gotta take it down to a darker room. Wow, it's like fucking glowing. How is it doing that? No. Seems like the only place we could actually tell what it. Oh, wait. Is it the same thing on both sides? I think it's just like cracked. I don't think we can see any numbers on there, so it's probably not that, but I'm going to keep that for now. Unless we find something with a clue on it. Hmm. Ah, is this could this be the code one six seven zero? I want no, yeah, okay. I want to hold on to that just in case. It may not be that one six seven zero. I really hope it's this. Cause I've been running around here for at least a quarter of an hour now. One, six, seven. Uh, oh yes, it actually worked. Holy shit! Thank God for that. Into our client's personal history, that I found details of a strong emotional response to someone who once worked within the mine. An entry that discusses the mine at great length but doesn't discuss whom the individual was that worked there. Continue to work your way down further into the mine. It seems the center of this memory is very much at the heart of these industrial ratways. I'll contact you if I gain any more information. Yeah, it doesn't look like we're going to go through there. Oh, wait. Um, please ensure all valves are in correct position before activating. Okay. And how do we know when they're all in the correct position, I ask? Huh. Um, open bow, close bow. Okay, so open, close, close, open, close. Open, close, closed. Open, close, open, close, closed, open, closed. Um, did I fuck up already? <laughs> okay, no, it was, yeah, it was open, closed, closed, open, no, open, closed. I think we're good. Now we can activate this. There we go, that went too hard. Now hopefully we can open the door. Yep, well, thanks for that, fuck you. Okay, it drained, oh no, okay, yeah, it drained the water so we can open the door. What's this do? Oh, there we go. Let's go. 
like we're getting somewhere. I'm not sure how long each level is. I mean, the game was three gigs, and the graphics ain't spectacular, I guess. They're not that bad. So it must be fairly long game, I guess. I don't know. Hmm. The fuck are you? Okay, let's just just say it's a fucking side quest. What do I have to do with the projector? Um, yeah, okay. Things we touch throughout our life can stay with us in the back of our minds. Shut up. Right, I'll leave her. Okay, it's obvious that we've got to put something there. There's another one here. What do we want to smash? It's not really can really pick up here, is there? We picked out that bottle. Maybe let's go and smash the bottle. Okay, ready? Okay, there's, pro there's probably something on. Oh, I hope that wasn't important. Yeah, I fucking hope not either. So we got to smash some. Why would we want a smashed bowl though? It just doesn't make sense. I know the the woman said something. I probably really should take notice, but too late for that. Why would we want a smashed bowl? Holy shit, man! That fucking made me jump. I just spam the square button. Okay, so are you seriously meant to make me think that I can I can rip that pipe with a broken bowl? You piece of shit. I got really lucky then. I could have been here sat here for hours. And so now it looks like we can do it on every single door, okay? I'd kind of like to read the the manual, please, because compressor manual. Yeah, I know, but if we've got to do something with these stupid compressor things, then maybe it would help knowing what the hell we've got to do. Unless we've got to do it ourselves or something. I don't know. We can open that for some reason. Hmm. Why? I... <laughs> that is so random. So just for leaving a book on a certain table. Seems like the technology is quite ahead of its time, but okay. Okay, now this one's open at least. Thank God for that. <laughs> Handles. What? Okay. Oh, I know, I know how to do it, I know how to do it, I know how to do it. Why have I got a feeling that I should probably listen to it? Am I hitting it? I'm hitting it. I don't know. Okay. Guess you're coming with me then. Or not. Okay. Yeah. Guess we're going in there then. Holy shit. Okay. 
No, I'm literally not controlling this, I'm just turning and shit. Okay. Can we stop now? Thank you. Oh, did we just jump off? <sighs> like stars are passing me by. Burning so bright and so fast as if they never truly existed at all. They're so beautiful. So fragile. I want to hold on to them. I want to hold on and never let them go. Why can't I hold on anymore? Please. Restorer? Can you hear me? Oh, there you are. I'm sorry. What you've just experienced was a relapse of our patient's condition. Hopefully you didn't cause too much damage whilst inside. Now, the objective as stated is to locate Jean's artifact. At this present moment in time, we don't know what this item is. We need to gather information from important memories our client can still understand. Their core memories. Alright, yeah, anyway, guys, uh, I'm gonna leave this episode here. I'm not sure if I'll record more of this, uh, depends what you guys think. I uh, mainly just wanna show this game out. It came out today on PS4. I'm not too sure, it might, may have been on PC a while back, uh, but I think the, they've upgraded the graphics and a few more things. Uh, I'm not too sure about that, though, anyway, but it definitely came out on PS4 today with PlayStation Plus. So that's pretty cool. But anyway, guys, let me know if you enjoyed it, if you would like me to upload more of this game. Uh, if not, I'll just keep it to myself in my spare time. Uh, anyway, guys, uh, if you liked it, please go like and subscribe. We'll see you next time. This, they will never know what they miss. Anything could happen again. And you will have to trust me.